These are the cardiac effects of nitroglycerin. The primary effect is that it reduces myocardial oxygen demand by decreasing left ventricular preload. So the key mechanism, we said it dilates venules even at low doses. It also dilates the arterioles at high doses, and it dilates the coronary arteries as well. The result of this is that you have a decrease in preload. This was the primary effect. This reduces left ventricular wall stress. You also reduce afterload. This is by dilating the arterioles. This is a secondary effect. And you improve coronary collateral blood flow. That's from dilating the coronary arteries. This can also cause a reflex tachycardia in response. Some pharmacology notes. Your onset is one to three minutes. Your half-life is two to three minutes. Your metabolism is primarily hepatic. The mechanism is that it activates guanylyl cyclase, which increases cyclic GMP, decreases calcium entry, and induces smooth muscle relaxation. Some clinical considerations. Nitroglycerin is first-line treatment for myocardial ischemia. However, it is contraindicated in hypovolemia, suspected inferior wall infarction, and concurrent use with PDE5 inhibitors. This can lead to severe hypotension. PDE5 inhibitors include Viagra or Sildenafil.